Yo, you guys know what time it is. It's street interview time. And we're doing street interviews on International Women's Day. And who better to do interviews on International Women's Day than a woman themselves? We've got a special guest, and that is... Connie. And what are we doing, Connie? We're infiltrating. We're infiltrating. Let's go. <laughs> Q, Q, B roll. <laughs> oh, she's so gorgeous. Yeah, she's pretty big before. She's already big. What does International Women's Day mean to you? Well, you know, it's mostly about women's rights for me and like making sure that they're protected. The acknowledgement and appreciation of how obviously women in the past not having as much rights or as much availabilities as they do now. Actually, I didn't think much of it that it even existed until recently. When we sold jumpers for Women's Day and it had all those different roles on it, like daughter, wife, and I don't know, mother, all those things. I'm like, wow, it's quite cool to celebrate those actually because that is very special. Not everyone can be a woman. Giving women a bit more sort of voice to the fore. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Only like Florence Nightingale and that sort yeah, of thing. Yeah, that's a really good one. Yeah. I, yeah. I agree. Or there is another one who a lot of people hate, but she got things done with mm. Margaret Thatcher. Just women in general who are just like uh, innovating. Uh, Rosa Parks is one, I will admit. Suffragettes? Yeah, the, the suffragettes. The suffragettes. 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 <laughs> 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 I don't even know that. Women who did, got the votes. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. What, those were the sewing okay. geezers, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I remember watching a movie about this now. Can you think of any inspiring woman in the Bible? Mary. Why? She gave birth to Jesus. Eve, she started us all off. Yeah, yeah. that's really good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, Mary. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mary, Jesus' mother. Mary. Yeah. 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 Pretty big yeah. one, that. I haven't really read the Bible, so I would find it difficult to, to name someone. Um, yeah, actually there is. It's, it's Ruth, and she was a foreign woman going back to her mother-in-law's country, which she didn't even know, but somehow she knew there is peace in it. Before I got married, people kept bringing this story to me because I'm moving to a foreign country and blah, and just knowing God is good, but not knowing what will happen. Generally speaking, in my experience, I'd say that they were pretty much made the same way. To an extent, yeah. Like, there's obviously... It's controversial, isn't it? But like, there's obviously like things that are more designed for like typical men and women and everything. But mm-hmm. it doesn't particularly mean like either can't do yeah. like the other. But it's just like generally. I uh, think so. Yeah. 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 Because yeah, yeah. you need men and women yeah. to work together to, you know, for to help the world, mm-hmm. get things done, yeah. etc. Yeah, I think I think they were. But not everyone, obviously, because some people don't. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think they complement each other. Yeah. Because like men tend to not show their emotions, where women do. Yeah. So that is complements each other that way. Yeah. 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 yeah that's good. That's a good Before this interview, did you think that the Bible belittled women? Um, I did, but that was only until. 2016 (laughs) when I got over myself and just realized we are actually in need of men like we wouldn't exist without men and men wouldn't exist without women there is no war against the other gender there is only a togetherness and only that is working yeah yeah I guess so Mm -hmm. I think it like fast thoughts you probably would think so yeah I I took like philosophy and stuff so I kind of had a lot of it like said that it wasn't so much when you actually look into it but I think like if you were just assuming you would think so. It's something that's part of many cultures in many aspects and it's not specific to one religion or one not religion. But I think it was more resolved around men than it was women. Right. Yeah. Like all Jesus' disciples were men, not women. I don't feel like I know as much as I should about all of this so I find it kind of 
like hard to comment. Um, as a Christian, I quite get often when I speak to people, when I speak to my friends, they think that the Bible and just Christianity or just religion in general actually belittles women. But actually, we, got, we just got one Bible verse here. And do you want, do you want to just say the Bible verse, Connie? Yeah. So it's Galatians 3, 28. And yeah. It, and it is, there is neither Jew yeah. nor Greek, no slave or free, mm. and neither male or female, for we are all one in Christ Jesus. Mm. And it's just a testament to how God sees us and views us equally. To be honest, it's quite reassuring in a way. That's the, that's the best word I can use, to know that such a, a religion with such a high following has that belief system in a way. I got quite excited because I was waiting for my husband to come for 10 years. Yeah. And, and I read like, no, he has to love you as Christ loves the church. Yeah. That's quite a task. I wouldn't want that task. No, it's a huge and so I'm like, oof, yeah. okay, you, you, you got to do this. I, I do the other bit and that's okay. Yeah. 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 Right, guys, we appreciate you for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, share, all that stuff. Not because we want the clout, but because it helps us out, you know, makes us know that you guys actually like what we do. You like watching what we, what we put out there. So, yeah. Hope you guys are having a nice day. Same thing again. Whatever you're doing, I don't know. Eating breakfast, lunch, dinner. I don't know. I hope you're having a wonderful time doing that. Have a great day, evening, morning. Snacks. Afternoon. All right. Ciao.